It doesn't make sense. Yeah, the like placement and everything. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, everything makes sense to me. <laughs> <laughs> but the who makes no sense also. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> okay, hi. Welcome everyone to our sixth Facebook Live. My name is Sangwa. I'm Anson. I'm Rui Ling. Yeah. Yuri is not here today, so um, <laughs> Rui Ling will uh, take her place. Okay, so uh, Facebook Live and Instagram Live and uh, YouTube. Okay, um, we are from Eastern Music and uh, if for those of you who don't know Eastern Music, uh, we are a store that sells traditional Chinese music instruments and we also do repairs and we also offer music lessons and we also uh, do performances uh, for corporate events. Okay, and every Friday at 5pm we'll be doing um, a live show here and uh, which we'll talk about um, certain topics on uh, certain instruments and uh, for the first segment and the second segment will be um, talking about some of our products and the last segment we have a short uh, music performance okay so today's um, topic will be all about the Yang Qin so uh, early on we actually posted a story yes. asking like oh what are we going to talk about today then the hint was like I tune one I tune one then <laughs> someone commented Liu Qin <laughs> I think because one the of the video. videos that I did for Yuqing. Yeah, so um, it's inevitable, inevitable <laughs> that since I'm here today, yes, I'll be taking yes. the spotlight on yeah. talking about the Yang Qing. So if you don't know, um, Anson is a specialist in the Yang Qing, okay? He I'm plays specialist. the Yang Qing since he was very, very young, is it? <laughs> <laughs> 16. 16. Oh, not, not, not so mm. young. <laughs> okay, so he's been, been through a lot of competitions and uh, he has a lot of experience in this instrument okay so before we uh, go on to, to to ask him about the Yang Qing I would like to ask uh, maybe Rui Ling um, what is your impression of the Yang Qing mm, it sounds really nice mm -hmm. sounds, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah yeah I agree that it sounds nice it sounds like like uh, a bit of piano and yeah chord. correct correct happy chord oops ha Hapsicot, yes. Yeah. And yes. Uh, also, ah. it sounds like uh, when we do the the, the runs, uh, it sounds like a. Uh, runs. <laughs> <laughs> cascading uh, waterfall. Whoa. Mm. Whoa. Sounds like a hub. Yeah, it sounds like a hub, you know. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, but, but why didn't you want to take out the, the Yang Qing? Okay, yeah. at first, at first, I was. Is this a true story? Yeah, yeah, yeah true story. Uh, I played the Erhu, but then at first, I opted for the Yang Qing. But then I. Oh, you did? Yeah. But then it failed. Why? Yeah, oh someone, someone took my, <laughs> took that. We failed. We had a poll, three of us. Mm -hmm. Only can one, only only one could go in. So, oh, so okay. if if anything happened, you might be playing the Yangqing today. My, you, you, you might be sitting here. <laughs> did you regret? <laughs> did you regret? Yeah. Uh, not taking out, taking out the Yangqing. Uh, it's not her choice. I mean, it's not her decision. <laughs> but oh, but not, I mean, were you glad that? Yeah. I'm glad. I'm glad. Everything happens for a reason. Oh, I'm so deep uh, and we're like what, two minutes into the live already so deep. <laughs> yeah, oh yeah, but then uh, good thing I didn't take out because like every time I look at the, the young thing is like so many strings crossing, so many strings, so yeah, many so complicated, stuff. right? I mean, yeah, all going on. You know Yang Qing has 144 strings. Yeah, oh, exactly. only has two strings. Uh. Yeah, we so how, how, how long would you take to tune the, the, the Yang Qing? <laughs> yeah. Well, uh, at, at the beginning, uh, of, of course, after a lot of string breaks, <laughs> uh, in the beginning it took around an hour plus just to tune one entire wow. yangqing. But of course, over time, uh, you can cut it down to forty minutes. Mm -hmm. It's still a very long time to tune, mm -hmm. but compared to us, yeah, or e or e done, forty minutes later. Yeah. <laughs> but it looks really complicated, you know, when you want to play a melody. Even the scale, I cannot. I mean, I play a few instruments. Uh. I play a few instruments. Uh. I play a few instruments. Uh. Mm. But uh, Yang Qing is one of the instruments that I cannot really get the hang of, you know. I cannot really do a scale. It goes up and goes down. It doesn't make sense. Yeah, it's like placement zigzag, and everything. Zigzag, yeah. Yeah. Oh, everything makes sense to me. <laughs> <laughs> but the earth makes no sense also. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> and the Yang Qing is totally heavy. Yeah, it's so heavy. Uh, to bring around. I can't defend. Yeah. I can't defend that. That, that accusation because uh, as a young singer performer myself, we do a lot of performances, right? Then I have to always call a cab to bring my young singer. 
Cha ching, cha ching. <laughs> so people who play Hang Sing actually have to be very strong and I wouldn't say rich, but being able to support their transportation fee. Oh yeah, I can't carry both. I cannot carry this. That's why you play elbow, right? <laughs> <laughs> Struggle. Have you ever taken a Yang Sing up the MRT or bus? No, but I actually seen someone do that before. Yeah, he was carrying the Yang Sing. With the father, the son and the father carrying oh. out of the MRT. Then the the guy was like, <laughs> should I check? <laughs> is it is it easy to uh, maintain? Yeah. So uh, Yang Xing, right? Because there's a lot of crest, a lot of like very small spaces, very lot of gets on uh, um, on top of the string. So I will always have to take a brush, paint brush, just to brush the corners, and I have to make sure that the the rollers have to be in very like in a particular order. Yeah, which we can get in, uh, get into, get in depth later when we talk about the Yang oh, Qing. Ah. Okay. Mm. All right. So, um, about the Yang Qing, how many types of Yang Qing are there? Oh yeah. So, uh, the most conventional Yang Qing that we've seen today in orchestras or even soloists, uh, is this model called Si Lin uh, ah, Four Zero okay. Two Yang Qing. Yeah. So we just bring one over. Okay. And then yeah. we can show the audience uh, what's a Four Zero Two Yang Qing. <laughs> yeah. So as you can see, this is a logistical nightmare. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so okay, we this one we require three people's strength to bring this up for the oh watch out. Okay, so this right here is a four zero two yang qing. So how do you tell it's a four zero? You guys have to maintain for yes, a while. Yes, yes, yes. So how does how do you tell that this is a four zero two yang qing? Well, first of all, you can see that there are four main bridges here. So one, two, three, four. This is four, and zero two means that. This, there's these two mini ones right here. So four zero two, and this is the most conventional yang qing you can okay. see so in the market. Ah, most conventional is in uh, most people use. Oh, uh, most people or... use uh, this instrument, and uh, actually a lot of composers, I mean, who write yang qing solo pieces, right? They write with si ling er yang qing in mind. Mm. Yeah, because the note progression, the placement of the scale, and everything is more fitted. For a four zero two yang qing, okay. now there is a four zero five yang qing or five sorry. So there's five bridges right. So oh. this entire chunk of note right, mm. you continue to progress here. So uh, I I did own one before one of these five mm. five bridge yang qing. Yeah, and it's it's not easy to play on. It's not four zero five. Even though the range is slightly bigger, but because of how the note the placement of the note. So it's not very. It's not the same as four zero. Yeah. So sometimes, right, it's better if there are. It's just like four zero two, but just some added notes here and there, which is <laughs> actually another Yang Qing that I'm Models, like. okay. Yeah, and another Yang Qing. Model. And that will be the four zero two G. G. Okay. So I'll do the switch. So this one is also a four zero two, as you can see, four long bridges. And oh, why why is this one missing? Because we shifted it up here. So it's still O two, four zero two. So if you can just draw your attention over to this bridge over here, you can see that other is not one, but actually they added three more bridges here. Okay. So meaning this one is chromatic. So it's B B flat A A flat G. So. Yeah. So what's the lowest note? E. E. Two yeah. octave. Uh, yeah, two octave below the middle E. Four zero two. You it, it can depend on you can tune it to E, F or F sharp depending on the piece. E F or, or F sharp. F. Yeah, because the lowest one is G, right? Mm. So, the, if the song is in D major, for example, you need the F sharp or G major, you need the F sharp. If it's in F major or C major, you need the F too. So. so usually, right, uh, the notes here can push with the slider. So, yeah, oh. yeah, but because this one eliminates the purpose for it, so there's no slide, not much slider. Okay. On the Yang Qing itself. So four zero two would have two more notes. Uh. Mm hmm. Lower. Four zero two G Yang Qing, right? There is a not many people uses it, even though it's I I personally really like this instrument. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because of the extended note. But in China nowadays, the most conventional one is still the four zero two Yang Qing. Yeah. Yeah. So the next one. Yeah. The next yeah. One. So um, we talked about four zero two Yang Qing and four zero two G Yang Qing. So the next model is also in the four zero two G configuration. But this Yang Qing is actually a very special Yang Qing because it's one of the first few Yang Qing to have a proper muting pedal mm. attached to it. This is the Dian Meng Yang Qing. Uh, it's 
started by a professor, Li Li Ning professor, uh, in Zhong Guo Yi Yue Xuan, Zhong Guo, uh, China Conservatory of Music. So, uh, we, can't, we can't shift the camera, so I prepared some pictures of the pedal. So, at the bottom of the foot pedal right here, yeah, and then uh, once you step on it, the pad, this muting will go down, so you can play the strings. Yeah, so this Yangtze is very revolutionary like during its time mm -hmm. because one, you can see that that's it. I, we can't leave it up because it's attached to the pedal. So <laughs> there used to be a board here, but it shifted all the way to this side. And then they added the distance of the bridges. So if at the previous two Yangtze, you see that this place is actually closer together. Oh. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and this one has a more length for the higher notes. But now they enhance the bass note and the middle, uh, middle range, so it become wider. And it, to fit that length, they move this entire thing over here. Yeah, and you can see that there's also no sliders on this young thing because uh, she thinks that it's better that the notes they all share the same cylindrical tube here. Yeah, so they're all fixed. So no, no fine tuning over here. <laughs> You, you are, and then tuning right, if you open it, so we usually tune Yangxing, we tune on one side of the Yangxing which is on the right hand side of the player. So when we tune right, we all have to do it one, on one side. But this Yangxing is special, he split everything in half. All the low bass notes and middle, middle range is here, and all the high notes are here. So that's, that's one thing special. Would you like to just hit and <laughs> the sounds without the... Yeah, so without the... So with the pedal on right, yeah. uh, this is how it's like. <laughs> this is played upside down. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> my, 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 my mind a bit wonky right now. This is really <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Just play with the pedal. Right? Yeah. So actually, it's pretty addictive to play with the pedal once you get a uh, pedal and sing. Okay, it actually works. Mm. Uh, is it in the same way as a? Piano? Is it the same way as a as a piano? I, uh, I heard that you play the piano, right? Yes, <laughs> yeah, I so. do. Uh, it actually works the same way as a sustain pedal. Mm. But uh, for piano-wise, even if you don't press on a sustain pedal, the note will still sound even if you press on the, the, the keys. Yeah. But for Yang Jing, it's, it's different. It's like entirely like, mm. yeah, <laughs> like it's cover totally your mouth like that. The, yeah. So the, the uh, pedal is mainly to cut off the sustain rather than... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because uh, Yang Jing, right, is known to have very long uh, sustained notes, like we were, we were very, very long notes. Yeah, so conductors will usually complain like, ah, please cover your hands, please cover your hands. They have to do this. <laughs> 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 the entire body, <laughs> So this one eliminates the need for that and it's uh, very precise and very fast. Just lift your leg up and everything just quiets down, which we can demonstrate later on. Okay? I heard they use right. this to practice, right? Like, let's say, you have to practice quietly. Or, or quite late at night. <laughs> <laughs> so at midnight, if I couldn't sleep and I really, really needed to practice, I'll just leave this. <laughs> and now it'll be weird, like, why, why the ancient room go? <laughs> <laughs> Oops! Oh <my> sensor, <laughs> sensor. Uh, the next one is also a 402 Yang mm -hmm. but it's a Yang Qing by Yue Hai. So Yue Hai Yang Qing, right now, I, I dare say that it's the most popular, most widely used, most well accepted brand. Right now, you are high. So, uh, let, let me just bring it in. Okay. Mm -hmm. So this particular Yang Qing, it's a 402 Yang Qing, but as you can see, it's, there's also pedals, like there's the muting attached to it as well. Let me just straighten it a little bit. Yeah, so it's, it works similarly to the Diemong Yang Qing, but the good thing about Yue Hai Yang Qing, or any Yang Qing from the Yue Hai company mm -hmm. is that uh, upon ordering or upon production you can actually have the option to add pedal or non-pedal Yeah, so this is my personal Yang Qing <laughs> <laughs> So uh, there's a need for me to add the pedal on it okay. mm. is, is there a name for this Yang Qing? Sorry? Is there a name for this Yang Qing? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is so personal Yes, yeah, so uh, you can, I'm not sure if you can see the colour clearly But actually, I, I don't Let me just, disclaimer, disclaimer number one I don't name instruments But this Yang Qing, uh, there's a backstory to it uh, I actually ordered it in black <laughs> <laughs> I ordered it in black colour and it came with this colour So, and 
I really liked how it looked, the wood cane and frame. Yeah, yeah, so because of the colour, I decided to name it Shiba. Shiba as in the Shiba Inu dog breed because of the colour. Yeah. The white and the brown. Very similar. Yeah, yeah. woof woof! <laughs> Yeah, so Enzo was saying that uh, now, nowadays if you want a uh, young thing with a pedal, you can mm-hmm. actually choose the model that you want and uh, you'll fix the pedal onto it. Not unlike the Diemo Yang Ching, which yeah. uh, comes in this it, particular model. It has to come with yeah. the pedal. But nowadays, uh, as long as you want a pedal, you can say that, okay, I want this model. It can be very cheap, a uh, very cheap Yang Ching, yeah. very beginner Yang Ching. Yeah, even the beginner 800 yeah. plus model, you can add the pedal also. Yeah, but it has to be. Um, you know, at the factory site to add the pedal, you cannot. We can't bring, do it here. Yeah, you cannot bring your yang in there. Hey, hey add pedal. Add pedal. <laughs> hey, add pedal. Yeah. All right. Yes. So the next yang thing that I would like to talk about, which is also to address your complaints and, frankly, my complaint too, <laughs> of uh, the yang thing being very heavy and bulky. So, uh, for two empty twenty. We would like to roll out, <laughs> we just rolled out, this, <laughs> this portable yang qing. So portable yang qing, right, unlike the mini yang qing, I'm not sure if anyone's seen this online on our story or my Insta story of me playing this really puny cute little yang qing. One of our EM sessions. Yeah, yes, if you watch our Winter Wonderland. Uh, where Pee Wee sang. Yeah, so you can see that there's this really tiny, small white yang qing that I call, lovingly call the mini yang qing. So this is not a mini yang qing. This is a portable yang qing. So if we could just lift it up. So it's way smaller, it's way lighter. Okay. Yeah, I can carry it like this. <laughs> yeah, so, okay, you have to hold it on now. So the conventional 402 yang qing, 402 yang qing uh, the longest span is 118 cm. But this one from the longest point is actually 98 centimeter. Mm. Yeah, so it's not significantly shorter but significantly lighter. Mm. Yeah, and you can see it's still in the full four bridge configuration, but it's 401. Yeah, because there's one small note missing here, uh. which I'll explain what's their rationale. <laughs> yeah, and there's, they eliminated the sliders also to cut short of space. Yeah, so everything here is fixed and they cut short everything. So let me just explain why. I'll, I'll just briefly say. Okay. So 401 Yang Qing right, is actually the uh, predecessor to the current convention 402 Yang Qing. Yeah, so 401 Yang Qing, right, uh, there's only this four bridge. They don't even have this range here. So this is actually a 401 and 402 hybrid. Mm. Yeah, so this Yang Qing is very suitable for people who go out to perform a lot like I do. Uh, so or just play geek music and stuff like that. So actually this note is not very widely used. We usually use this G note, that's it. You mean it's not widely used in traditional no, not com- music? Yeah, no, no, yeah, traditional music or yeah, it's just not used. Not used. Uh. So mm-hmm. any any pieces that you can play on 402 it- Technically speaking, you can play. You can <laughs> <laughs> Technically, yeah. you can play. Yes. yes. So this one is lighter one, and they also use less string. So, uh, <laughs> oh, <laughs> so it, uh, you did ask. Oh the yeah, question. I I was I was asking how come there's only like one one one. One and, one one. And there's only two strings <laughs> two, here, two. but <laughs> but the other young thing there's like three or four. Yeah. So yeah. yeah so to cut, uh, to save space, so they drill less holes here. Oh. Yeah, so this entire thing is shrunk. Mm. Uh-huh. Yeah, so they so they attach less strings, so they use less string. So it's not as loud. Could you could you play something on this? Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So sure, I'll demonstrate a short uh, excerpt. So this is the small yang qing, and this is how it sounds like. Oh, like family gathering. <laughs> okay, so uh, lost. <laughs> Wait, 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 wait. 
the sea <laughs> just how long it sounds if there's yeah. no pedal. That's why you need a pedal. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so this Yang Qing, right, it's not like the very full-bodied sound, but it's actually very well managed. Decent. Yeah, it's very decent. It's good for outdoor performances. It's good for just practicing at home if you are learning leisurely, for example. Would the space be... be a yeah, yeah, so that's, that's one of the things I was very worried about when I was... when I when we first got this Yang Qing. Yeah, but actually the spacing is quite similar to... Yeah, it's quite similar to the conventional 4-0. To, very similar to Shiba. <laughs> very similar. Yeah, it's easy to progress because it's closer. <laughs> Yeah, and to address your concern, like how uh, everything is crisscrossy. Yeah, I can't right? see it. Yeah, so if yeah. if you look at the thing right now, right, everything is like crossing path like that. Yeah, so uh, learn to focus on things when uh, throughout the chaos. So I always <laughs> whoa, <laughs> you're not the only one who's deep. <laughs> <laughs> so you we always focus on these white spots on the bridge. So on the bridge. Yeah, so you don't look at the crisscross. Because crisscross, you're just gonna play two two notes. <laughs> So always look at the bridge. Okay, but don't hit on it lah because you, you hear you hear that. So hit. Yeah. Oops, C sharp. Alright. Mm. Mm, okay. Yeah, so this is the um portable yang thing. And how how much are we selling it for? I think it was six fifty or seven hundred. Okay. Yeah, around that. So oh, this yeah. thing will be available on on our web store. Okay, yes. our web store. Yeah, soon. So once you have seen this video, uh, and we have attached the link, means it's ready for purchase already. So do look out for this very gorgeous, very light. I would like. I would really like to emphasize again, just how light, how light and small this thing is. It's like oh, I can carry it like this. It's really light. Yeah. Right. Okay, so <laughs> so in conclusion, yes, in conclusion, yes, Reiling. So have you uh, changed your opinion about the Yang Qing? Maybe, but I still what? don't know where to. I still don't know where to hit. Where are the notes? It's not like piano. Yeah, I like, think I'll I'll, I'll I'll still leave the Yang Qing stuff to you. Right? Yeah, I have a question though. Yeah. Like if it's 402 Yang Qing, mm-hmm. 401, 402, uh, does it does it like all fit the same casing, or you have to buy like special? Oh casing? yeah yeah yeah. Thank you for pointing it out. So 402 G right? If it's by Yue Hai, the size is the same. But if it's by any other brand, the slinger G tends to be wider mm. because they want to fit the uh, low, the extra bridge space. So they usually make it wider. So uh, if you're a 402 Yangqing player or 402 Yangqing G Yangqing player, right, when you want to get the case, you have to really make sure to yeah make sure that you know what model it is. So when you buy your Yangqing case, you just have to really mention what size is it because right. usually sellers would know what fits what. Like the non uh non Yue Hai Si Ling Er G will not fit the Jia Yue cases. Oh uh, yeah, so the Jia Yue cases are the very shiny, shiny, bling bling one. <laughs> yeah, so okay. that one can only fit four zero two Yang Qing. So you have to take note of that. All right. Mm. So in Wait. conclusion, <laughs> Yang Qing. It sounds a, nice. It sounds <laughs> nice, but it's big and bulky. But due to techni- technological advancement, wow. So now Yang Qing's are getting smaller without compromising on the sound quality and also smaller with pedal. So we really look forward to what the future will bring for Yang Qing. Yes. Mm. Okay, so as usual for our last segment, we have a performance by none other than... Me! Me! <laughs> 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 Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Okay, <laughs> so yes, so I'll be performing a very classic Yang Qing uh, piece. And one disclaimer, I actually learned this piece two days before. Just a self-challenge for myself. So, it's so a, what's the name of the piece? Yes, the piece is called Jiang Jiang Ge. Jiang Jing Ling. Jiang Jing Ling. It's called Jiang Jin Ling. General's command.
person performing. Yeah, just a disclaimer again. We actually practiced this two days before the shoot itself. The Sounds good. Yeah. Thank you. No need to Thank you. <sighs> Alright, so if you are interested in uh, Yang Ting, please visit our web store to have a look or you can come down to our shop and we can show you all the Yang Tings that we have. Mm. And if you are interested in learning how to play the Yang Ting, uh, we do offer Yang Ting lessons as well. So you can contact us uh, for more information. Mm -hmm. And, and if, you like, if you like what you have see, watched and you would like to see more, so to follow and subscribe to us on Instagram, Facebook and on YouTube. Sorry, a bit breathless. You should continue. <laughs> and if you have any questions or comments, uh, please leave uh, your comments at the box below. If not, see you. I'll see you again. Next yes. week, 5pm. Bye. Bye-bye.